Hello guys, welcome to PHP Basics section 1.1. 1 .1. Uh, before we jump into programming in PHP, we're going to talk about installing some text editor. The first one is Sublime Text. The Windows version is 11 megabytes. You go to sublimetext.com to download. The second one, Atom, uh, is about uh, 181 megabytes. You go to atom.io to download. And the third one is Visual Studio Code. Uh, for the Windows version is about uh, 53 megabytes. You go to code.visualstudio.com. Uh, now, the first Sublime Text is my favorite uh, a text editor because you just install this text editor. is a very lightweight and everything you need is already pre-installed. Autocomplete shortcuts reinventing. Uh, I started using Sublime when I was in school learning programming and since then every time I try uh, a new text editor I go back to this one. So this text editor is my favorite. Uh, the second one is Atom. Atom, I tried to use it for a couple of days. I hate it because the lag. Uh, there's so many complaints about uh, this text editor that uh, lags a lot. Uh, you type 20 characters there's a lag and errors on the right side for packages which is very annoying if you want to use this type of text editor i would suggest you go to dos your dos and you type atom in safe mode basically it tells atom if there's any errors in the packages uh, packages do not run it the third one is visual studio code the most popular uh, text editor in the market um, I use it about 20 to 30 percent of my projects, but uh, the problem with this, there's so many extensions that you will have to install. If you want autocomplete, you have to install an extension. If you want shortcuts, you have to install an extension. If you want reindent, you have to install an extension. So uh, it's pretty annoying. And I had a problem, uh, PHP reindenting, it's not as nice as Sublime. Sublime, the reindenting uh, of uh, PHP is extraordinary. But else, uh, this text editor is one of the best. It's my second favorite. Uh, but Sublime will always stay uh, the fir uh, my favorite one. So uh, thank you very much for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and wait for our next video for section 1.2.